Hey, Ryan Stileson here. And today I'm going to talk to you about a topic that not many people know about, and it can really help you get a lot more leads. And it is setting up a LSA page for different verticals if you take different verticals on the LSA platform. So what does this mean? What it means is that if you're a business that can perform services for different verticals on the LSA platform, let's say you're an attorney and you can do both attorney work for family law and you can also do PI work. Well, you would wanna set up an LSA page for both of those verticals. Or let's say you're a contractor and you do contractor work, you do remodels and you also do roofs. So you would wanna set up a separate page for each one of those categories. So under the categories or the verticals, you want to make sure that you set up a separate LSA page for each vertical so that you can spend your budget the way that you want to. There's a certain way to do this. So let us know if you're having issues with your budget, your bidding, that sort of thing. Because a lot of times what ends up happening is if you have one page that is running ads for two different categories, then Google will sometimes what they'll do is they'll spend all of your money on one vertical and not the other vertical or category. A vertical is another name for a category or job types. And what ends up happening is that you end up spending your money the way that you don't want to. So you would get a bunch of, for example, family law cases, or you get a bunch of roofing jobs, but not a lot of other type of contractor jobs. And if you simply do this and implement this one strategy, you will not only get more of the types of jobs that you want or cases that you want, you will also be able to better identify how you're spending your money. And you'll better identify how or what your cost per acquisition is, which is one of the most important things that you can really keep track of. One of the things that I talk a lot about is what is your cost per acquisition, okay? And really the only way to determine this is to do what I'm suggesting right now, is to separate out your ad spend into different categories or different verticals so that you can identify, okay, I'm spending $5,000 a month on this vertical and I'm spending you know, $3,000 a month on this vertical or this category and it led to this many jobs. And so my cost per acquisition is X for this and Y for this. That gives you much better insight. So then you can make business decisions based on how much you're spending on each of those verticals. And the only way to do that and the only way to know how to make those decisions is to do exactly what I'm suggesting. And there's a way to do it and to set this up. We also get data that tells us other things like where you should open up your next location. This is for one location and you're creating two different pages, okay? Because there are a lot of businesses out there that have a lot of different locations. Or you can have multiple locations, but what I'm saying is that each of those locations can have multiple pages, okay? So I just want you guys to, to, to get that as well. So there's a lot of reasons to do this. Again, separate out your pages so that you can identify what your cost per acquisition is so that you can spend the money the way that you want to spend it instead of the way that Google wants to spend it. Because if Google spends it the way that it wants to spend it, it might not give you the type of jobs that you want. It might spend all your budget on one type of job or one vertical and not the other vertical. So this is a way to, to make it so that that doesn't happen. Okay. And these are just, this is just one example of how we can make your local service ads run more efficient because everybody thinks that ah, we don't really need somebody, you know, it's not that big of a deal. These are not big issues. I'm here to tell you that we run into this all the time and it's more of what we do to, to prevent you from losing leads and losing profit because we can typically save you what you spend on our services in just the disputes that we get approved for you, okay? And then the other thing is, is that it's what we do to prevent you from harming your local service ads page because if that happens, then your lead volume can just fall off the cliff. You know, we can also fix a lot of things that you guys have done. We get things done very quickly because of our partner level support. So let us know if you have any questions. You can text me at 619-304-5155. Again, 619-304-5155. And if you want, you can text the word audit and you'll get an audit questionnaire, 12 questions. 
You don't have to talk to anybody. You answer the 12 questions and you get your results back immediately. So let us know what questions you have. Thanks, and we'll talk to you soon.